Yo, what's up guys, it's your favorite Toad, you're back again with another video, in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to make this insane Ida and DaVinci Resolve. The template will be in the description, as well as the font, so make sure to download both of them, and yeah, after you've done all that, just make sure to open up DaVinci, and I'll see you when it's open. Alright, after you have your DaVinci Resolve open, you just want to make a new project here, you can name it whatever you want, I'll just make it like Ident template, uh, tutorial, and then I'll just do that and I'll open it up and now you want to go into your edit tab here and change this to 60 fps go to your edit tab um, and make the project 60 fps or else the template will be messed up and now you just want to drag in a fusion composition here so just drag that right in um, just keep it at the same length and if it's just make it five seconds long um, and yeah and now you want to go into your fusion fusion and go to where you downloaded the template so for me it's right here it would just be called God Ident Template for DaVinci made by me. So um, you just drag it into your DaVinci here. And uh, just connect the transform here to the media out. And that's it. And now to change the name, you go to your change name here. And then I can just change it to whatever you want. And I'll just put like Toad or something. Make sure it's all caps to make it look good. Um, and then go to this change name here. And also change this to Toad or whatever your name is and to change the color you go here uh or you go here actually no you'll go here and then you can change the color to whatever you want so if i want red i can keep it at red and then um for this one you can change the color uh, i think if you go to shading if you go to shading then you can change the color to red too or whatever you color want to use but you want to go to shading here so go just go to your text, it'll be here, and then go to your shading, and then change your color there. Now other than that, you don't have to do anything else to the template. You just change your name here, and change the color on the background here. And that's pretty much it. Um, now it can just render out. Oh, and also, you need to change the color of the drop shadow. So the drop shadow is right here, so you just want to change it to your color again. So I just keep it as red, and you're going to change it to your color. And that's pretty much it. So all you need to change is the name here uh, and the shading color. And then go to this name, change it, and change the background color and the drop shadow color. And then now you can just render it out. Um, you want to green screen this, so just go to your generators here and drag in a solid color. And then make the color like green or like any color that's not in your ident so for me it could be like blue green or anything like this if your ident has green in it obviously you don't want to do green or else when you uh, delta key it out it will just be transparent so i'll also put i'll put like green but if your ident has green in it don't put green but like blue or maybe red um so yeah and press ok and now you can just render here so you just want to make this uh 1080p 60 and restrict to just spam a bunch of ones or twos or just a bunch of numbers make this 31 and then go to advanced settings here change this uh force to bear and then you can make this mp4 and then uh, just go to where you want to save it so i'll just save it in my downloads for now and let's do ident tutorial and then you can just save it and then now you can add to render queue and just render it out Alright, so after you've rendered it out, you just want to drag the ident into your video, and now it just has a green screen. Um, so now you want to, you can delete the audio here, you don't really need the audio. Uh, you want to go into your fusion tab, so just click fusion again. Control space on your keyboard, or shift space if you're on Mac, and just switch up the delta key here, and then just add this one. It's, it should be only one, uh, and if it doesn't add, you can just try it again. And now I just want to make the background color here. Just drag this pen onto the background and it should be clear and transparent. So as you can see here, it's clear and transparent. And yeah, it's like, and you can see your ident. It looks really clean. And that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you did. And let me know any tutorial ideas in the comments down below. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.